Welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to make a delicious pasta. This pasta is very simple, but it's very, have a lot of flavor. If you want to see this video, stay tuned. Okay, here I have one box of pasta. This is uh, 16 ounces or one pound. I'm using the spaghetti, but um, you can use any pasta of your preference whatever you have available. You can follow the instruction on the back of the box, okay? Or simple, I have a pot in there with water, which is boiling already, and I'm gonna add a little bit salt and oil, and then I'm gonna add the pasta in there, and I'm gonna cook the pasta for eight to 10 minutes. So follow me to the kitchen, when I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna cook, cook my pasta. Okay, now my water is boiling, and I already add a little bit salt and just a little bit um, oil. And I'm gonna add my pasta. Um, usually you can put a hole like this, or I wanna cut it in half. So I'm just gonna go ahead, cut it and break it in half like this. Like this, and I'm gonna add them, okay? But you can put a hole if you want. This is what I'm gonna do with the whole thing. And if you have the other uh, type or kind of pasta, you can just go and dump it in there. Okay. Now I have the, uh, the pasta in there. I'm gonna cook it on cover, like I say, for eight to 10 minutes, okay? Or until the pasta is completely done. Okay, now I have fresh vegetables, okay? Um, I wanna mention, if you wanna add more vegetables, you can go ahead and add more vegetables. In here, I have cilantro. This is how the cilantro looks. All my vegetables are already pre-washed. I already washed the uh, cilantro and the onion. And I have like a full hand of cilantro. I'm gonna cut this by hand. And I have an onion, but usually I'm gonna cut it in half and I'm gonna add just a half of onion. That's optional. If you wanna add a whole onion, you can go ahead and do it. And in here I have sweet peppers. This is sweet. And I have two red one and two yellow one. You can also add red pepper or green pepper, just a regular pepper you find at the store. Or you can, if you want to add like a spicy thing, a spicy kick in there, you can go ahead and add some habanero, jalapeno to that. That's optional. In here I have garlic, fresh garlic, which I have four. And I'm gonna use this thing in here to mash the garlic, okay? And in here is parmesan. But if you have the fresh parmesan, it's even better. You can shred it, it's even better. I'm gonna go ahead and cut all these vegetables and then I'm gonna show you what we're going to do next. Okay, it's very important that you come and um, just check it. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn it off and I'm going to drain this water, okay? Now I put a little bit of oil, as you see. I put it in medium high. And let me explain you something. I already separate the cilantro from the other vegetables. I want to mention, if you want to add more vegetables, if you want to add carrots, if you want to add a broccoli, you can do that, okay? and you can cook it in there. That's up to you. So I'm gonna saute this vegetable first, which is the, the sweet peppers and the um, onions, and we're gonna add the garlic later, because if you're gonna add the garlic now, it's gonna have like a, a bad taste. It's gonna burn. It, it, yeah, exactly. We're also gonna add a red pepper. This is optional, this is spicy. Red pepper flakes? Yeah, red pepper flakes Crunchy a little bit. Peppers. If you don't wanna add this because you don't like spicy food, that's perfectly fine. You leave them, leave them out. What we're gonna do is we're gonna saute these vegetables in here, and then I'm not gonna saute this. I'm gonna put this in the pasta the way it is. But if you wanna saute it with this, that's perfectly fine too. Okay, go ahead, let's go ahead and saute all these vegetables. And you use the whole onion? And No, I didn't use the whole onion. I just used half of the onion. Half of the onion, okay. Okay, well, we, well, what you're gonna do is, now you're gonna stir this. 
I use this uh, a wooden spatula. It's better for me because I don't spray my 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 pad and my skillet. And it's gonna take like three to four minutes. I want to mention if you if you don't want to cook the vegetable and you want to put the vegetable rice, you like the onion like the raw onions, raw pepper. That's fine too. Just go ahead and put it in there, and then you're gonna sprinkle some of the uh, coconut oil or olive oil. Okay. And but I'm doing this for a couple of minutes, and me uh, remember. Don't leave this unattended because you don't want the vegetables to burn. And depending on how you like the vegetables, some people like it crunchy. If you like it crunchy, you know what you're going to do. You're going to leave it only one to two minutes. If you like it cook a little bit longer, and then you're just going to go ahead and stir and let it cook for five to seven minutes. So I'm going to see you after five to seven minutes. Now I'm going to add the garlic and I'm going to continue um, cooking these vegetables, okay? This is the garlic. Okay, so I didn't like this vegetable burn, honestly, but I told him, no, that's fine. Uh, that's fine the way it is. I like so, it even more than that. Yeah. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and put the cilantro in there. I already churned the stuff off, and I'm just going to go ahead and mix the cilantro, and then I'm going to put that in that pasta, okay? I'm going to put it right at the pasta right away. Yeah, with the oil in there. salt and pepper it's very important that you try to taste it and if you adjust the salt to your taste um, you shred it you stir it and then you taste it I'm going to serve this pasta with a delicious lemon butter salmon and I have the recipe on my channel at the end of this video I'm gonna put this the, the click I mean the square the recipe just click in there and it's gonna um, it's gonna take you to the recipe so this pasta is good give it a try and I put a, if you don't like spicy stuff don't add this because this is spicy add a little red, kick to it it's red pepper crush it's not too spicy but for those who don't like spicy stuff don't add them okay but if you are a fanatic lover a spicy a food add this well you're not a fanatic was it spicy for yeah, you it's not too it's not too spicy i'm not a fanatic spicy i don't like to be, oh, I don't like to eat too much with spicy, like a spicy food, but if it, the pasta or certain uh, food had a kick of the, of the heat or the uh, spicy, I like it, but not yeah, too spicy. Because I, I love spicy. I didn't taste any spicy. Yeah, there. so this is very good. Let me try. Thanks. <laughs> ah. 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 That's how 
gonna get the food one. <laughs> That's when you make it a bomb. <sighs> Beep. Food. That's what happened, and I'm sweating already. And that, I don't even got no meat, so. So if you want to add some meat, you can add that in there, but make sure the meat is cooked, like chicken, beef, whatever meat you like. And, or you can put the meat on the side. Shrimp, or sausage. Shrimp, yeah. Or you can add some or more vegetables. Like I said, like broccoli, carrots, make sure you cook them and add that in there. So, but the way it is like that, it's just perfect. So thank you for watching. And I'm gonna show you the final result when I cook the salmon and then uh, when I make the plate, that way you can see the final result. Okay, Sally, what are we doing? We are serving food. Serving food to eat, right? Um, this is the salmon. Uh, I overcook it a little bit. <laughs> and we're gonna serve this. If you wanna do some vegetables on the side, we was probably gonna do some green beans. But um, we're hungry. I don't wanna wait anymore any longer. So. And this is the final result. Let's put it in here on the table. And let me show you guys. This is the final result with the pasta, with the um, salmon and any kind of meat you like. No, it has to be salmon. can be um, chicken or any any kind of meat or just, if you are vegetarian, you just go ahead and eat it the way it is. Also, uh, Ariane is going to try the pasta. Go ahead and try the pasta, mommy. And let me know if you like it. Um, let, me, let me have this it's good. <laughs> Thumbs up. <laughs> you see what the pasta do? I told you. <laughs> okay, la pasta. Tastes good. Does it taste good, Willow? I'm gonna taste it now. Taste. La va a probar. Taste it. Taste it. Taste it. Is good, Willow? Yes, yeah, Willow. Try that. Está rico. Vamos a ver ahora a Soilin. And this is the final result of the pasta. I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Share with your family and friends. And I want to remind you that my videos is also in Spanish. Thank you for watching.